Okay, well, welcome once again to Unscrewed Storytime, when we tell you all about the people of this wonderful community. Uh, now, you two, I understand, you two have known each other for a long, long time. Uh, can, can you tell me uh, about when you met? Yeah, you know, it started way long ago, really early in our lives, a whole month ago. <laughs> it's a long time. Yes, I, I imagine for some younger people it feels like a longer time than it does for the rest of us. Um, but, but where did you meet? Antarctica. Antarctica, yes. Yes, you see, uh, we were doing this internship over there, uh, and we both managed to get in the same lab, you know? They're really dedicated to studying their ice over there. A lot of ice, really good study material. It had to have been very stressful uh, living and working in Antarctica together, just because of the harsh climate and all of that, did it help you two grow together, or were was there some tensions as you as you two spent time there working? You know, that's a good question. How, how do you say we got along? The penguins. Yes, the penguins. <laughs> yep, it's very cold there, as you said. Harsh conditions, and there's a lot. There is a lot of penguins there. So on those colder days, if you ever get stuck outside. What we do is that we'd go together and we'd find like a nice group of penguins and then, you know, become friends with them. You know, if you have any fish, they really get close with you. And then, you know, little cuddle, cuddle party. It gets really warm when you're all together, all their little feathers. <laughs> <laughs> so so what, what kind of work were you, you said you were studying the ice, I suppose that makes sense in Antarctica, but uh, what kind of internship was it? What kind of work were you doing? We were looking at the ice. I was actually assigned as an art student there. And, and and was this to uh, like paint landscapes or, or to learn about how to create art in in uh, rough environments? You know, I, I don't. I that's why. Flowers. I asked. There I, aren't I'm flowers. No, 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 no. Antarctica isn't known for its flowers necessarily. Um, <laughs> Well, t tell, tell me this. Have you two continued to work together? I mean, obviously you're not in Antarctica anymore. Uh, so ha have you two continued to work together? No. No. <laughs> that first time, really it. What? <laughs> what was it? I mean, obviously it wasn't lack of communication that was the problem. <laughs> So, so what was it that, that caused the, the... Why why haven't you worked together again? Uh, well, in fact, you guys probably that one time when we were ice fishing, i telling them the story. Oh, yeah, there were seals, and the seals, they they ate all our fish. Um, so I'm mad at them for that. And she uh, thought it'd be real funny to throw one of the fish on me, see what <laughs> the seals would do. I... I kind of side with her on that. That sounds kind of funny. <laughs> <laughs> but, yeah, uh, so, so what has brought you back together uh, now to, to tell the story? Are, are you two thinking of, of working together again? or? No. <laughs> <laughs> but, you know, I did have this recent assignment. I've been meaning to ask her if you want to join me over no. it. Okay. <laughs> Did I get this interview because I knew? Yes. Um, well, let, let me let me ask you this. Obviously, you've you've had issues. Uh, anybody who's paired up on a research project has had to work with people who maybe they don't get along with. So, what would your advice be about working together with all sorts of people? Don't. Put a fish on them in front of a seal. Yeah. And see. 